Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Um, I'm gonna give you all some um, some money messages, okay? So first of all, I just wanna say this, it's not for everybody, but this is for probably more than who I think it is, but you, it's time for a job change, okay? It's time for you to look for another job. This job has served its purpose. It's, it has did what it's supposed to do for you and your family. It has did what it, again, it's done, it's done served its purpose. It's time for another job. It's really time for you to look for something or uh, search for a job that is more satisfying, okay? People out here, if, you, if you're gonna watch the news, if you're gonna, um, listen to the propaganda what's going on out here. Yes, it's crazy out here right now. I get it. But it's all about your energy and what you're putting out. Okay? Propaganda is out here so it can make you afraid. Put fear in you so you don't move forward. So my advice to you is to go within, figure out what it is that you really desire when it comes to work, how you want to feel at work, even if it's this, this is an entrepreneur endeavor. Figure out what this is so you can move on, okay? Um, with this energy, um, with, you know, it's, time, it's, it's just showing that it's time for you to manifest something different because this job doesn't serve you. It's, it's, it's not serving a purpose. If you're getting off work, you're tired, you're depressed, you're fussing all the time, and you always feel like that the job is just a little too much for you or you know the job suck and you don't want to be there it's time for another job. it's time for another job if you if you done got yourself entwined with the co-workers what you really should not be doing anyway yeah it's time to cut your losses with this job and move on okay this is letting you know that um financial challenges are over okay it's over i mean you might be going through financial challenges now but if you take the time and do what you have to do you're you're gonna um you're definitely going to win, okay? Or, okay, that was not for everybody. For the ones that's happy in your jobs, you might be getting a raise, okay? This is, you might be investing. You might be, it might be like a lot of, again, a lot of investment opportunities coming to you so you can um, increase what you have. But increasing what you have, you can't be a consumer all the time. Being a consumer, that ain't, that's not how, the, and money doesn't work like that. And you, if you pay attention to the wealth, which I've been doing a lot of reading and researching and looking at videos and everything, wealthy people really do not consume. They're not consumers. They do enough and they keep it moving. Of course they gotta pay their bills. Of course they have to have clothes and stuff like that, but they keep it at a basic. They keep it basic. And that's how you, that's how you will succeed, okay? Now, you will have um, stability in your life, okay? But this is also saying that partnerships, this is in reference to a marriage, uh, coming together with somebody, uh, coming together with a different company, and you all are uh, tackling these financial commitments together. Trust me, this is the way to go because it's so crazy out here today that partnering with partnering with someone who is on that same level with you where you can make you and that person can make money y'all making money and y'all taking care of bills together that's how you increase okay and for the ones that don't want to rely on nobody miss independent mr independent okay no worries <laughs> do you but for the most part most people are looking into partnerships where they can balance the scales right now since everything is a little bit more expensive so pay attention to that okay this is saying that um you're going to have a lot of money coming in as long as you take care of your business okay you're going to be fulfilled you're going to have a lot of prosperity uh, a lot of propositions come to you in reference to your finances a lot of new opportunities so you have to pay attention to the opportunities that you being offered that that are being offered to you right now, and that is gonna let you know like okay. So if out the blue someone is saying that oh well this company right here is this or 
um, this entrepreneur endeavor or is really good, you might want to look into some of this, this some of that and, 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 and do your research and see what it can do for you, okay? All right, um, a lot of people have been having a hard time saving, okay? So, and sometimes, some, some people are going through a lot of, a lot of, um, let's see, how can I put this? Some people have invested in the wrong thing, okay? So, investing in the wrong thing right now, uh, or well, if you don't invested your money and you're not getting a return, that means you made a bad, bad investment investment okay but at the end of the day you can always come back from that so don't let that stop you okay sometimes you some some people don't have to dive into their savings and that's okay or uh, we get it okay and this is the whole purpose of saying going you know trying to do things with a partner okay it doesn't have to be romantic y'all that's the thing it could be a you can do a roommate situation and i know i i I'm, I tell you that roommate thing, I get it. I, I'm not telling nobody to do anything. You do what's best for you, and that is that. Because I get it. So, but this is saying that um, in order for you to move forward, you're going to have to put some hard work. Not really hard work. I'm not saying that. That's, that's not correct. You got to put the right energy out. Do your research, okay? But you're going to have to work. The, the work is the information that you find that is going to help you move forward, okay? Let's take the hard stuff out. It's no such, I, I'm, not, I'm not going on that past stuff. Hard work? Hard? No, we're not doing that. Only thing you can say is pretty much is that you, you're going to be consistent with your work. You're going to be consistent with working and consistent with moving forward with your finances and putting plans in motion, building a team, and you know, so you can get that job security or your entrepreneurship endeavors will be a securement for you as well. But you do have, you will come out, if you are going through some financial difficulties, you will be coming out of that, okay? Take some time, I'm sorry, not sorry. <laughs> Burn a candle, do your affirmations, you got to talk. Money is energy, and if you don't treat money right, money is not going to treat you right. And people think that like that, that like we talking like it's a joke. Everything is energy. Nothing else matters but energy, and money is energy. If you just spending money just to spend money, <laughs> you show money that that you know you don't you don't respect it really. Okay, some people it's okay to ball out sometimes, sometimes, but at the end of the day. It's time to, you know, to manifest more money. It's time to take action action, and be ambitious about this. And it's time to hustle. It's okay to hustle a little bit. Hustle is good. Hustle is good to keep it going. And keep your, keep your, keep your gears going. Keep it working. Keep your, keep plans going. And keep your plans flowing in motion, okay? All right? But um, at the end of the day, it does say that, you you know, you're going to be you're gonna be lucky in money. You are probably already lucky in money. That's the thing. And it's working out for you, and it's just letting you know that you just need to continue because, again, this world is changing. Financially, everybody going to the grocery store, we know what's up at the grocery store now, okay? So, with that being said, like, we got to, we got to do things smarter, okay? You got, to be, you got to be smart with how you're moving and what you're spending your money on and how, you, how you're spending it and... and like you just can't just spend it, just spend it. That that's it doesn't work like that anymore. Okay, all right. So um, definitely take the time to really focus on your finances. Put your affirmations out about your finances. Know that money is an energy. Know that you will have all that you need. Don't ever think about the lack. The lack is going to keep you in that lack frame of mind. Um, that lack is going to keep you lacking. So get out that lack frame of mind and know that. Everything is going to happen the way it's supposed to happen with your finances. But I know when you in it, you're like, well, I'm in it right now. That's the whole thing. You got to change your thinking. Because for every negative, there's a positive. For every positive, there's a negative. So it's not going to always be that you're going to be without money unless you're just one of those people. Now, I don't have nothing to do with that. That's something you have to change, okay? This is nothing that nobody else can change but you. 
So with that being said, I hope you guys know, got the message. Money is energy. Be careful how you're spending your money. Um, invest, take risks. If your money is short right now, it's okay. It's okay. Give it time, I promise you. You will see more money than you've ever seen before if you put the right energy out, okay? I love you guys. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.